everybody making it out, certainly the players for all the work you put in and the coaches and the parents and everyone else. But before we really get started, before I uh, introduce the mayor so we can get up here and get on with business, here's my line. Your rock, your hill. Okay? Rock, hill. Rock, hill. champions uh, along with all other champions that we have in Rock Hill and many other leagues many other sports but we're thankful for you coming tonight the football players their coaches the bands the cheerleaders the parents everyone who contributed to a very successful football season in Rock Hill one more successful football season in Rock Hill one more state championship field season of football in Rock Hill and one more uh, one more in, in and a way of many to come here forward. So thank y'all for coming tonight. You know, we have a lot of things to be very thankful for and to take pride in in Rock Hill. Football City USA is probably at the top of the list for everybody here tonight at least. And so we want to have a good time and we want to thank everybody who's coming. But with that, the, proud, the Sports Commission is proud to support sports of all kinds here in Rock Hill. And we thank y'all, the football players, the state champion, Northwestern Trojans, the state champion, Rock Hill Lions, and the back-to-back -back state champion, South Carolina. For all you've done this year, and all you'll do uh, going forward. So with that, I'll introduce the mayor, Doug Eccles, of Rock Hill. Well, good afternoon, and congratulations. We are so very proud of each and every one of you, and we're excited to have this opportunity today to recognize all of these wonderful uh, individual players and congratulate them for their hard work and uh, congratulate all of you parents and supporters and, and all of the uh, school and coaches and everybody that's provided opportunity to even be here today. Uh, we've had a lot of success in football and a lot of sports. Uh, throughout the history of Rock Hill and certainly today recognizing three championship teams is certainly an opportunity for us to to celebrate and I'd like to uh, on behalf of our city council we'd like to uh, make three presentations one to each of our championship programs and the first program to be recognized and let's give him all a big hand for uh, his work is coach straight Heron at South Point Stadium <laughs> Okay, let me share this with you very quickly on behalf of the uh, mayor and the city council. Whereas the South Point High School Stallions football team won South Carolina Class AAA state championship for 2015, becoming the first Rock Hill area school team to win back-to-back -back state titles in the modern football era. Whereas South Point High School became the Region 3 champions, South Carolina AAA upper state champions, the South Carolina AAA state champions by defeating and shutting out Midland Valley High School by a score of 35 to nothing. Whereas South Point High School produced seven Region 3 AAA All-Region players. And whereas South Point High School produced six of the Herald's first team All-Area players. And whereas South Point quarterback Greg Ruff was selected the Herald's All-Area Player of the Year. And whereas South Point High School roster included a Shrine Bowl of Carolina's player, Chris Smith. And two touchdown winners and cooperative bowl all-star players, uh, Nick McLeod and Greg Ruff. And whereas South Point High School's roster included one USA Today All-State, All-South Carolina team member, Nick McLeod, and one Max Prep sophomore All-American, Darion Kendrick. And whereas South Point High School football team was ranked number five in Charlotte Observer Sweet 16 poll number four in the WBTV Friday night poll. Now, therefore, I, Doug Eccles, Mayor of the City of Rock Hill and the City Council, to hereby take this opportunity to congratulate South Point High School football team and Coach Straight Harry. Congratulations! <laughs> We also have one here for for the uh, YMCA All Stars. Whereas 
the Rocket YMCA All-Stars with coaching staff led by Winfred Hood, won the state championship in 2015. Whereas the Rock Hill All-Star made up of players selected from the 11 and 12 year old Gray Y age group. And whereas the Rock Hill All-Stars beat all of their playoff opponents by a total of 156 to nothing. 156 to nothing. Whereas the Rock Hill All-Stars beat Florence 20 to nothing to win the state championship. And whereas the Rock Hill All-Stars running back Nigel Moore, center marshal staff were selected to play in the All-American Bowl in Texas, all in state championship. And whereas Winford Hood was selected to coach the Rock Hill All-Stars after finishing the regular season coach of the Bellevue Wildcats, who earned a 10 0 record and won the Gray Wise City Championship. Whereas Nigel Moore was voted league MVP after leaving the Bellevue uh, Wildcats to the city championship. Whereas the Rock Hill All Stars were supported by all three high school football teams and coaches in Rock Hill schools throughout their playoff run. Now, therefore, I, Doug Eccles, mayor of the city of Rock Hill and the city council, to hereby take this opportunity to congratulate the Rock Hill YMCA All Stars and their coaching staff. Another champion, yeah. Northwestern Trojans. Where's uh, yeah. Whereas the Northwestern High School football team won the Class 4A Division uh, Two State Championship. And whereas the team's 14-1 record marked the fifth time in school history that the Trojans finished the season with a state championship. Whereas the Northwestern High School football team won the Region 3 4A championship and the city championship in 2015. Whereas the Northwestern High School football team finished the season ranked nationally by Max Preps and finished the highest nationally ranked team in the North and South Carolina for 2015. Whereas the Northwestern High School football team has finished the season nationally ranked on three different occasions. 2010, 2013, 2015, whereas the Northwestern High School football team finished the season right unanimous, number one in the state rankings, whereas the 2015 Northwestern High School football team was selected as the NFL Monday Night Football Team of the Week, whereas the 2015 Northwestern High School Trojans had numerous players finished with all region, all area, all state accolades, including numerous Coach of the Year awards for head coach Kyle Richardson, whereas 90% of the members of the Northwestern High School Class uh, 4A Division II state championship football team placed on the academic honor roll, whereas the Northwestern High School defeated Lexington High School 63-13 to tie the largest defeat in South Carolina State Championship history and tie for the most points scored in the South Carolina State Championship game. Now, therefore, I, Doug Eccles, Mayor of the City of Rock Hill and the Rock Hill City Council, do hereby take this opportunity to congratulate Northwestern High School football team and Coach Kyle Richardson. Congratulations! Ms. Dr. Kelly Pugh, who is school, uh, superintendent of Rock Hill Schools, and Mr. Jim Vining, who's chair of the Rock Hill Schools Board of Trustees for the next presentation. Please give them a round of applause. Congratulations. You know, there are very few towns who can say what we're saying today, that not only did we have teams that went to championships, but teams within the same town who won those those championships. So congratulations. I want to thank the adults in your lives who have worked really hard um, to get you to this place. Thank you for your hard work, the model that you are not only on the football field, 
but in the classroom and in your community. So thank you so much for what you do. Congratulations. And at this time, I'm going to turn it over to our board chairman, Jim Binding, for a special presentation. If you played high school football this year in South Carolina, you had a 3% chance of being on the championship team. If you played high school football in Rock Hill, you had almost a 70% chance of being on the championship team. But more important, in Rock Hill, whether you're on Gray Wire or on your high school teams, you have a 100% chance of being involved with coaches, volunteers, and adults who prepare you for the next level in sports and in life. And I would like you to all, uh, let's have a round of applause for the co all the coaches and the adult volunteers. Now there's no way I can talk as fast as Doug Eccles or the Juarez, but we do have uh, some plaques. And first off, I'd like to call up uh, Coach Hood with the Gray Y. You know, this puts pressure on our high school coaches when our young players excel at this level to keep it up. And so we really appreciate you putting the pressure on our high school coaches. <laughs> right, next up, uh, I'd like to recognize Northwestern coach Kyle Richardson. Coach Heron, Stallions. And, and, that, and now I'm going to turn it over to Coach Heron. Thank you. Uh, Football City, USA. This is a great place, man. And I, I think we all should be very proud of what our city's done today. Thanks to Mayor Eccles and City Council for uh, bringing us out and having a great event. I want to thank uh, the Rock Hill School District uh, for the plaque and for all the support. Uh, and most of all, I want to thank my players and my coaches uh, that that have stuck with us and, and done things the right way and and continue to, to create a, a feeling of, of trying to excel, doing the best possible job that we can do. And uh, we want to continue that as we keep going. We will thank this town for all the support. And of course, before I go, I have to say thanks to my, my wife and kids uh, for, all, for everything that they do and do without me. <laughs> thank you. Thank you, guys. So man, it takes a lot of hard work. Like I told my guys, I said this will be the first state championship you ever won in your life. Won't be the last because we do got some of the best high schools in the state. That's like a lot of rock here football, football city USA. We take a lot of pride in that. And uh, when I was telling my boys, I said, man, uh, it's gonna happen. We put God first. And, and we already gonna win the state championship before we get out of here. We put God first, we're gonna win, guarantee you that. They did what we asked them to do. Uh, spoke with, uh, Coach Straight, and uh, he told me to go on and get it. I talked to uh, Coach Richardson, and he said, bring it home. And, you know, they came out to our practices, and that's what it's all about, one unit, yeah. one city, Football City, USA. Yeah. All right, so I don't leave anybody out. I wrote myself a text. Uh, thanks for everybody coming out. First off, I want to thank God for putting us in this position to uh, be able to be with these kids every day at school, on the field, and off the field. Uh, thanks to the mayor, 
Sports Commission, the City of Rock Hill, uh, Rock Hill School District 3. Uh, congratulations to uh, Straight, the South Point coaching staff, South Point staff.